Alright everyone, welcome back, and uh, I changed my mind about the recording. I am actually recording in 60 FPS now. Oh why, let's finish this bullshittery, shall we? There will probably still be some more secrets, maybe another secret to boss fight. But that, once again, will be saved as a bonus episode as usual for the series. It's a go, it's a go, go. Look at that, city lights. Ah, fast travel shortcut thing. Very epic. What a bow! Be cold, be tough, be sweet. Airward, absorb the war and became stronger. Be careful. Whoa, faster. Wow, I'm already at max DP. Be cold. Be tough and also be sweet. You watch coldly. Susie snorted. Tit. Ralph says smiled sweetly. I guess it liked all of that. Ugada! Shoot me move! And Susie, where? Told where why you'd beat them up. They're crackles with fighting spirit. I'll say winks demurely. Alright, so it's this same attack pattern. I believe just circling around would be the best way to deal with that. Okay, wow, okay, never mind. It's random. It's always aimed. No wait, that that last one wasn't. Okay, that that attack is fast and weird and I hate it. Da -da 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 -da. Watch Coldy, Susie laughed, huh? I'll say winks the early. Just staring at him works. Who did this? That was the strangest fight ever. <laughs> oh, I've never seen Noel wear anything like this. Oh, the statue rocks. Hey, Ralsei, like, can we take this for my room? Uh um, that would be stealing. Still, the Susie likes that. I'm I'm gonna have to check that. <laughs> your catalogs of search results. Seems like most things couldn't be made into objects. In the search is IC real cryptid. It's cross between IC and something else. <laughs> hey Chris, take this for your room. Um, that would be stealing. <laughs> it's a calendar. Every page is the last month. Every day is the twenty fifth. Bed and go to sleep. It's not your bed anyhow. It's a wardrobe. Hell yeah, let's sleep in Noelle's. What if Noelle came in here? Yeah, what if she has ticks? Get out of there. Fair point. Huh. Children of the city see so need in neon stars. Uh, it's been a while since we did this mechanic. Whoops. Hmm. 
Oh. There she is! Queen, stop right there! Ah, oh, my sweet dear children! You are just in time to witness my world domination! With Noelle in my possession, it is only a matter of time before her will turns and she unleashes her power, blanketing the world in... Too late, dumbass! Noelle's with Birdly! Oh, and who this? Birdly, but he's been intercepted. My control plugs are now suitable for teenagers. Now the whole family can enjoy eternal servitude. Sort of regal, mostly cruel laughter. Oh! Wait, then where's Noel? Oh! <laughs> I wonder. I actually know the answer. Enough already. Oh dear, I do sincerely quite like you two. It would be a shame to force you to serve me. An enjoyable shame. <laughs> Can't do birdly? Bro, group loosen. All right, let's go with throw. Dang it. Queen, think of the lightners. Aren't we supposed to make them happy? Is that not what I am doing? Holy shit. My Ralse is fucking dying. Battlefield feels electric. I should have gotten more items. I'm an idiot. Also use the butt juice. Think, lightners have already been enslaved by me and my kin. What the? Queen's acid shield is formed. Okay, interesting. Ooh, Red Buster and Dual Healer back. That glass of acid is generating her shield. So, uh, you gonna drink all that? No, this is all mine. You can have it. Queen sips from her acid. Each day, they spend hours worshipping and glowing rapture on screens of funny animals and candy the games. Smells like overclocked high heels. And those did the queen. Queen sips from her acid. What a fucking idiot. Staring, tapping, to receive joy. Staring, tapping, to avoid pain. Easy enough. I deal best with bullet patterns like that. Right, how about group loosen instead? Nope. It's. Yeah, doing it with Susie's better, albeit harder. Until recently, when the town's internet disappeared. Now the refuge they take in the screens will slowly fade. Ooh, it's like Gaster Blasters. Only with less room to dodge and smaller bullets. Smaller blaster lasers. Damn it! Noel. Then who will help her? Her strange and sad searches. Who will answer them? The 
fountain flows ominously. Alright, I'm not gonna try going for all three of them anymore. It's what I wondered until the night appeared and created this wonderful world of darkness. Can I go down? Nope. how we're uh, gonna kick your ass. It's a good thing I have no standards for this. Oh, I wonder if I can attack the shield instead. No, the path is clear. All I have to do is expand this dark world. Nice, that works too. And with the world covered in darkness, no one will have to suffer anymore. Gotcha. Instead, everyone can live in my perfect mansion. Every day, blissfully worshipping me like we both deserve. Whoa. <laughs> gotcha. Now, stop resisting and welcome the new age of darkness! Super weird. Don't know how to dodge that. I think you're supposed to just stay in the center and move up and down. But I'm an idiot. We won't let you control everyone with your wires. Whoa, when did I say I would do that? Yeah, that's more effective. Uh, you're literally controlling Birdly now. Oh yeah, that's just for him only. Enough, you foolish children. You may have survived my attacks, regular, but I've been secretly been downloading my ultimate move the whole time. Now perish in the bosom of my hellish rain. No, don't attack. So that final move was supposed to be cool, but the internet's down. <laughs> Ooh, interesting.
I don't like moving box gimmicks. I already had enough of that with the with the king guy. There we go. Yeah, my final attack, like I was going to put like memes in it and stuff. <laughs> I did it. Not bad, you foolish children. What the? What are you doing? Why isn't my control wire working? Thanks to my comrades' kindness, their mercy. Now, it's time for me to take my freedom. Queen, you may have mastered the number three, but can you stand up against four of us? Running simulation for the number four. Hmm. You are definitely going to kick my ass. What? Unless. Oh no, what that? <laughs> wait, what that? Wait, wait one nanosecond, you. You coward debt! You ew! Alas! Birdly? <laughs> Just now, was nothing more than simple bravado. The truth is, that wire already absorbed all my succulent energy juices. Birdly? Hey! Hey, Birdly! Are you okay? Everything. Getting dark. Only. Only a kiss from a beautiful gamer girl can save me now. Fuck off. Birdly. What? Like, get your, like, losing consciousness and stuff. But, could you speak up? Ah, um, sorry. Suddenly I, I, I am feeling a bit better. Hey, that's a relief. How is everyone fucking in love with Susie right now? Susie's gonna get a harem by the end of this. By the way, like, holy shit, it's kind of crazy. Well, uh, gotta hurry and save Noelle, so later. Ah, uh, dear Susan, so enigmatic in her ways. If, if you... If you really are devoted to her, the very first and nicest thing you could do is learn how to say her name properly. But I can read her heart, Chris, like a health meter. And it's beeping for love. Haha, <laughs> well enough tales, Chris, good luck. May the smarts not be with you. Okay. Okay, indeed. Chris, your deep concern for me is dextrose, but stay sanguine, my fellow bluebird. I'll find some way to help you yet. The night. The roaring night. Today, it is day to create this world. Reaching its long hand to the sky, it cursed its will into its blade and made, thrusting the fountain from the earth. Unfortunately, the world they created is trapped within the confines of the library. If only we had a way to make more darkness, we might be able to cover the whole world. That is when I realized this power, this power of the will, this power of determination. Is this not something that all lightners possess? If one was simply determined enough, could not anyone make a dark fountain? So then, if the night has taken its leave, then I will simply make a new one.
Noel, honey, darling, sweetie baby. How do you find the giant hand? Great. And how do you feel about world domination? Oh, ouchie mama. Yeah, freak off with that. But Susie, you, you came to save me. Somehow I... I... I knew you would. Uh, you did? Um, I mean... Um, um, well... Wait! Wait, 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 wait! You need to get out of here! Hurry! Huh? Queen? Seems that you failed to notice! A giant freaking robot in the middle of my palace! This isn't good. She's she's invincible like this. Huh? She's she's been bragging about her final form all day. Damn it! It's raining and I can't hear anything. Heh. <laughs> you think growing a few inches is gonna help? Yes. Are we cool to take over the world now? S Susie, let's just give up and... Hell if we're giving up now! S Susie? So what if you got another form? We've got one too! Chris, Ralsei, come on! Ah! What are you doing? This is our ultimate... Um, wait a sec, now that you mess... Oh no, it appears I am evenly mad! I hope you won't mind if I don't hold back. Ah, you do boogoo! We're falling. Any bright ideas on how we're getting out of this one? Um, we could try flapping our arms. Fear not. Your knight and glow in the dark armor is here. Birdly, epic. Chris, Susie, my energy is still too low to help you fight. So I found help for you. Behold, comrades! Yeah! On your quest against Queen, you've made all sorts of buddies, right? Using our jump-making skills, we modified everyone to work together. I shall also take credit for this. What? Uh, he's got strong will. Chris, Susie, behold! The ultimate group ride! Yeah! <laughs> With his plans and face! A flashing light! Happy Bravari! <laughs> Meow noise! <laughs> My energy! Squeak noise! <laughs> Said they're loving kids! <laughs> Fresh cooking! <laughs> Organization! And most of the all, whatever it is! <laughs> oh my god! Are we gonna do punch out again? <laughs> Oh yeah, baby! <laughs> Finally, a worthy opponent! Our battle shall be legendary! Fight. <laughs> Giga Queen blocks the way! Laser mode! Turbo dodge! Self fix! Alright, no mercy for you. The time for words is over. Now is the time to fight only. Boda! Shit. Well, I still suck at this kind of. Alright, uh, what happens if I defend? Ah, just kidding. I totally will keep monologuing as I kick at your face. Young for fighting. Alright, let's save up for that one. The time has come for Noah to realize her own strength, her own will, her own determination. We're 
their X to hit Queen after she attacks. Yes, I get that. Laser mode engage. I like quick aura fired up. Focusing into her blade, she will create a Neo Dark Fountain. Then another, then another. Ora, 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 ora! Ora, 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 ora! Ding ding! Round 2 begins. Queen's attacks get tougher. Then, when the whole world is covered in darkness, she and everyone can live in bliss, free of fear and suffering! Whoop! Bah, bah. Ora, ora! Ah, shit! Dodge too early for that one. So he mashes the controls trying to punch more. <laughs> uh, maybe dodge? F heal, I mean. Healing R fired up, but the TP cost increased. Oof, alright, can't rely on that too much. Chris, Susie, why don't you help me too? Create the world of your dreams! Also my dreams. Ook. Ook. Shit. Yeah, I suck. <laughs> Please smash the controls, time to punch more. Susie, bro, just let me cut out the chop you and you can have skateboards. As many as you want. Oop. Timing's a little strict, ain't it? Said escape roars past. Alright, let me do turbo dodge. And dodge and iron on and Increase, my dearest Trucy, you can have as many. Okay, I don't remember what you liked. And didn't I answer what was my favorite thing in the beginning of the game or something? Oh no, I'm dying. Hey, was that a third guy? Shit! 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 Uh, fuck! Don't give up! <laughs> Alright, let's, let's... Let's do better this time. Alright, I got this. Full on offense. Ah, oh, just kidding, I thought I'd keep monologuing. Ook. Shit. Okay, I still suck. I got this, I swear. I'll say advises you to dodge then counter punch. Yeah, I got. I'm just being an idiot, okay? Whoa! Then when the whole world is covered in darkness, she and everyone can live in do 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 Ah! 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 Shit! Shit! No! Come on! Why do I suck? <laughs> that's my- that's my Susie face thingy that she does. Third time's the charm! Let me focus, cause I actually suck at punch out. <laughs> I be I never even managed to beat the Nintendo Wii game thing. 
now all I do nowadays is watch speedruns of it. I can't play I can't play my Wii anymore. Including my Wii Punch Out game, sadly. But hey, this is cool. Shit. I'm gonna heal. See why I'm happy to you? Oh, heart! Right, I forgot about this. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna save up my TP for healing only. Susie, bro, just gonna cry, chop you, and you can have as many skateboards as you want. All right, third base. I got this. All right, let me defend. What the? Oh, I was supposed to duck that. I thought I was supposed to punch that. Because <laughs> that was like the real one or something. Hey, was there a third guy? Whoa! 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 Shit! Shit! I suck so much! Ass! Then me and all of you will become super strong and cool! Meanwhile, I don't need to improve because I'm already perfect and can shoot lasers from my fancy glass. Whoa! That was really heating up. We can say that again. Okay, I believe I made my point. I'm going to please procedurally loop my dialogue now. <laughs> Okay, I really can't afford to be an idiot now anymore. Shit. Why do I suck so much? Ass! Oh, wow, look at my face cam. It's shitty. Hold on, let me do something about that. Ta-da! I swear I can do this, guys. Bam! Uh, any, anything that isn't bullet hell is... I can't dodge.
Shit. Shit, wrong. Alright, back to the third round. <laughs> I love that line so much. <laughs> Shit, why do I keep running into her bullet thingy splash? You've earned the right to remember what your fighting machine's true purpose is. To get your own tra ass trashed. By me! With my final attack! Haha, <laughs> bye! Ugh. Overheat activated! Listen well, you may have defeated me, but I still possess one thing you three will never have! Detachable hands! Ow, oh, shit! Well, darling, honey, sweetie, gravy. Take the pin I gave you and stab the earth, creating our new supreme empire. I, I, what? Wrong, Noel. I know it would make you happy. Or should I, with the last 1% of my battery, crush Susie into 8 bits? Even in her last moments, he's still making those leave. Leave Susie alone! You think listening to you makes me happy? No! I'll never be happy, not if I'm controlled by you. Why can't you understand that? No, well, perhaps my computations were miscalibrated. No, well, disregard me and, with your own power, choose the world that makes you happy. 
Queen? Queen? Queen, are you okay? Seems she ran out of battery power. Guess we can seal the fountain now, right everybody? Everybody? Queen, she said. Just the world that makes you happy. I don't want to live in a world ruled by her. But that wasn't the case. I wonder if this world wouldn't be so bad. Huh? Susie, don't you think so too? I, uh... Now that you mention it, Chris, isn't this world just better? I make so many friends here, you know? I've never had an adventure like this before. With axes and battles and magic? Where everything can be healed with a little spell. And no matter what happens, no one tells us what to do. Gosh, yeah. So, even if things were really scary just now, I mean... So is there any reason not to? Not that I can think of. Me neither. Then, Noelle, let this be my real apology. Concentrating my will into this blade, I will make a new fountain! And unleash a bright future! A future that shines for us! A future whose brightness is born from darkness! Stop! What in the world are you all doing? Well, we thought we'd- STOP! I mean, STOP! Do you realize what will happen if you do that? I will- we'll just... You'll bring the roaring. When the light is subsumed by shadow. When the fountains fill the sky. All will fall into chaos. The titans will take form from the fountains and envelop the land in devastation. That's hardly fun. The surviving darkness Crushed by the darkness, will slowly one by one turn into statues, leaving the lightners to fend for themselves, lost eternally in an endless night. Is that your idea of paradise? Oh damn, I did not know that. <laughs> you didn't? But your whole plan was to... I'm just a computer, Lamau. I don't know everything. I was just guessing based off the knight's actions. Why the heck hell would I want to end the world? Well, that's a relief. Uh, um, I'm sorry. I, I, after everything, I just caused trouble for you again, Noel. That's okay, Bernie. I understand. I thought I about it while charging my battery. You cannot calculate other people's feelings. And wait. What does the knight want then? So many world building stuff happened here. You cannot calculate other people's feelings. You you understand how I feel? Not really, Lamau. I just don't want Noel to be sad. Uh, well, I'm glad you two kind of get it now. Cause we all made a pretty sweet team in the end. No, we freaking didn't. 
Can you let go of us now? Oh yeah! It's Susie! Hey, you stood up to Queen! Not half bad! But really? The uh, yeah? Just guess you gotta wake up soon, huh? Uh-huh! Everything got so intense I forgot it was a dream! Then, I just hope I get to have more dreams like this. Hey, Noel, when you wake up, um, well, I just wanted to say, uh... Well then, I suppose it is time for you all to exit. Running program tendergoodbye.exe I will miss each of you. Noel, your unneeded honesty. Susie, your foolish bravery. Chris, your chill vibes. Bugly? Doesn't have to be a goodbye, Queen. Chris can take you back to our castle town. You and all our recruits can leave there. Oh. <laughs> Deleting tender goodbye.exe. Alright. Time to do what we came here for. Hey, Noelle. If you see the real Susie, just, just know that maybe she's in need of homework. Look, she doesn't have a tail, okay? <laughs> okay, I got it. It's not a secret. Let's just go, Chris. I'm being pushed. Okay, well then, well, this is going to be one health of finale. I got a whole lot of talking to do. Chris? It looks like we're here again, huh? The Roaring Night. Whatever they are, they're making these fountains. But is that really a bad thing? Since they started showing up, since they started showing up, everything's gotten a lot more interesting for us, hasn't it? Well, we don't have to think about that now. Chris, it's your turn. It's as if your very soul was glowing. Huh? What? What happened? Oh, it was a dream, wasn't it? Huh? A dream? That was all... a dream? Uh, uh, of course! That must have been a dream! Such feelings, such thoughts... Oh, sweet lady of justice! To think I would ever think Susie would be... Susie! Susie? What are you doing here? We came here so we could do our project, remember? The... Uh, you invited us to study, remember? Oh, right, I, er, uh, I... What? Studying with them? No, well, heavens to yikes! They're, they're... Well, I guess we could try it. Huh? My, my alarm? Oh, I'm going to be late for my shift with Miss Boom! Oh, no! How's it that late already? Well, out of you, everyone, I must gather my book longings. Ah, how I love the text your freshly picked up books. Now, let us hasten, my dear Noel. Good day, Chris. Susie? Bye, Chris. And, um, bye, Susie. Um, see ya. <laughs> what? What? Are you looking for something? Nothing but <laughs> That is her problem anyway. We to treat someone who just saved the world. Chris, hey, wait a sec, Chris! We we just actually saved the world, didn't we? Damn, we really are heroes. No one even knows. 
Guess it's better that way though, right? People freak out if they knew the world's in danger. Though, kinda sucks Noel has to forget too. Whatever, let's get out of here. Aw oh, man, and I was hoping I could get Noel to join the next adventures. Never restate the art public laptops on like that on. Computer monitor flickering brightly. Trash can. You get the feeling it doesn't have any friends. Start to explain why you feel this way about a trash can. It's a recycling bin. Someone accidentally printed off a lot of useless emails. Someone tried to check their email, but the internet's down. So full of many backup devices like extra mice, extra keyboard, or extra more office. It's a computer. Dolphin screensavers advertising some kind of malware. Our poster is talking about internet safety. So I thought about how your day might have been different. The poster with that orange cat was still on the wall. It's a computer, the monitor is flickering light brightly. Closet is spacious and full of all the electronics. A large person could easily feed inside. There you go. That's the entire cyber world. Before you left, you gathered up everything in the room. I did? Yeah, sure. No one's going to find that suspicious. And no one's... <laughs> How do you fit all of that? A book here, you look the page, it's delicious. This must mean what they meant by flavor text. I can go in here now. I love reading books, especially the book upstairs. It's book one about souls. Read it. Soul has long been called many things the font of our compassion, the source of our will, the container of our life force. But even now, the true function of it is unknown. How to care for a human. It's a book for monsters on how to care for humans. There are photos of unfamiliar humans inside. You shut the book quickly. According to the card in the back, looks like your mother took it out repeatedly many years ago. <laughs> Man, it got late, didn't it? Guess you should go home, huh? Alright, you don't have to say it. You wanna walk home by yourself, huh? Well, you're gonna make me, I guess. Let's go. Wait, uh, shouldn't we... Maybe... Maybe? Hi, honey. How was your group project? I can give you a ride home in just... In a minute, I am just... Oh, no need. You are still spending time with a friend. Oh dear, two days in a row, Chris. Is that a record? Have fun, honey. Be back before sunset. There they are. So this is your castle town. It's not bad. Chris, Susie, on behalf of everyone I protest, thank you. I am going to be your wacky roommate now. Okay, I guess I don't have a choice in that. Hey, Chris, I bet you have a lot of people to talk to, but you don't have to do everything at once. Save and take a break anytime you want, okay? After a long day, the town has grown once again. We're filled with a certain power. This thing really never changes? Ah. See the bagels here now. There are many fresh faces in town, I see. It warms this old club to see such hope. I was even surprised to see the Queen again. Same as ever. Well, aren't we all? 
啊。Right, I want to see our rooms. Oh, a terrific voice adventure. Time to kick off my feet and relax. Oh, my lord, this I humble servant uh, right here, whenever where I never left this. New birds had a wild ride. Time to settle down. Give my wages to the week. Still behind bars for some reason, but it's okay. We've grown to love this hellish place. You may have bested me, but you'll soon face someone more fearsome, more tyrannical than you could ever imagine. We we already met her. What? Wow, nice hamster wheel. So you too have come to humiliate me. No, I'm serious, it's cool. <laughs> that water bottle, however. Do not speak ill of the royal water bottle! It's nothing compared to the one in my mansion. Hm. Materialistic as always. Materialism evaluation denied. I simply give myself the treatment I deserve. You slept curled upon a dirty throne every day. Enough, wrench! What purpose have you here, Queenie Beanie? Just thought I would send a message, Kingy Wingy. And you don't have to worry about Lance. I will be looking after him from now on. After all, I am his mother. When was that decided? Arbitrarily right now. Hmm. Do what you please with the boy. But if he cries, bounce him on the ground like a ball. I think it is time to abort this conversation. As you wish. Oh, quite sorry, my king. <laughs> Queen has a new man about town now. Who? Yeah, who? Uh, I think I left my puzzle on. Post haste! Who was that? Bro, uh, that was my son's lesser father. You cannot calculate someone less than you. Be gone! Bye bye, Kiki Wiggy! By the way, did you want anything from this doll? Cashews. Order processed. isn't the best thing in your room. Yeah, <laughs> jealous of my cool statue, Chris. Oh, uh, what? No, it's not me, it's just cool. Susie, Chris, toothpaste boy. Queen's teaching me all sorts of things about being a bad guy. She's like, how do I put this? A third father to me. A girl dad, if you will. You mean a mom? Go outside and play, peachy boy. Peachy boy, peachy boy. Welcome. This entire castle is now my room. Um, I was going to set up something upstairs. Why, I already have everything I could ever want. Friendship, fans, and a small round boy. Now go and play with your friends, Peach Boy. I keep ending up in this situation. Can't say I'm a fan, or can I? Chris, do give Noel my regards. Any leftover regards you can give to Birdly. <laughs> <laughs> She was a cool temporary party member, I guess. 
Hey, Trashy Boy is here now. Oh boy, oh boy, I'm Trashy, huh? <laughs> I bet I'm gonna make a lot of new friends! A wonderful place, thank you. This town, not that restaurant. It looks weird, I'm not going in. Young Masters, thank you for such a wide space to clean. The people here have such clean hearts as well. So kitty. It's nice to make friends that like good clean fun, so kitty. He's, he's not in the cafe anymore. Ooh. <laughs> Boss, this cafe is so unrefined, so plain. Why don't we make it into an animal cafe? Give me one of the animals too, boss. Oh, thanks. Good evening, boss. We found a strange hooligan trying to turn the cafe into a second bakery. I was spinning and crying as my men carried him out. We do not predict any further difficulties. Now please, you've worked hard, boss. Relax and enjoy yourself. For the young prince, we recommend the vanilla green tea. It's not much to go off based on besides your color. Today's meal is scripts. Hex sign. E23D28. It's been deep fried with the finest JPEG artifacting. I hope it suits your palate. Or palate. She'll be back. Hey boss, we're just reminiscing about fighting you. Apparently, okay. Hey, ambulance. It's not done with the sick. It seems I got everyone in the end. All is well. Yes, ABC, you've got three chances, boss. It's everyone in a row. It'll take some stamina. Chapter 2, All-Stars. Huh. Well, there's a lot to do. I'm sure someone else can cover it. As for me, I just want to see the ending now. So I can watch everything without... Worry or regret of getting spoiled since I'm already in the post game anyway. Later, loser. Da 
tan 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 Tammy, Tam still study, study hard. Tam get a smart to go to college, achieve dream. Then Tam become, Tam become. If you could even envision it. Poor Tam, go subscribe to Tammy. She has a channel. You know. <laughs> nah, I'm just here to hang out. Silver Drake, I've never beaten this boss before. Alright, hand it over, honey. I got this. No, Dad, this is my battle. So, um, how about just tell me what to do? Haha, uh -huh, sure. How about trying Fire Shock? I'd love to, Dad, but the mage left the party. Oh, yeah, how about one of your 99 Blaze potions? Um, I'm saving those. For what, your birthday? Come on, live a little. Okay, Dad, this one's for you. Hey, yeah! It reflects fire attacks. Ah, whoops, hey, you gotta heal. I wish I knew healing magic in real life. Then I'd make you better and it wouldn't just be me and mom. Your mother is. Hey, it's okay, sweetheart, I'm getting better. Might even be able to go to church tomorrow. Really? Are you sure you're okay? Holidays happen whether you like it or not. Even though everyone likes holidays. Well, gotta go home. Soon, her mom will call. See you tomorrow, honey. Hi, Dad. Love you. Susie, why are you here? Help, I know. Sorry, guys. This game's only one player. Um, Dad, this is, um, Susie. Oh, this is Susie. Susie, nice. Heard a lot about you. You, uh, have? Cool, think I have to go now. Susie, huh? Yeah. Lay a finger on her and I'll kick your ass. <laughs> Just kidding. Well, kinda kidding. You okay, bro? Sorry, I <laughs> used up a lot of my energy just now. Probably not gonna be very fun to talk to. Thanks for visiting, though, Chris. And you too, Susie. <laughs> Seems like I need some more tests. So just gotta wait it out. They can't keep me down for too long, baby. Sooner or later, I'm busting out of here. Besides, your dad ain't much without his main man. What is it, Christmas? Look, Chris can't say much, but Noelle might look like she has it all. But her mother, her mother, you know? Love her, but she's tough on her. Normally, I balance it all out, but I can't do much when I'm not there. But I'm gonna get better. I have to. Hey, Chris. She's a nice girl, huh? The hell are you taking her here for? Why don't you take her to the movies? Hey, yeah, the hell didn't we go to the movies, Chris? Yeah, and take me too while you're at it. Yeah, Chris, come on. Kettle corn, Chris. Big. Don't skimp out. Siren. Uh-oh, Alphys. Hell if I'm going any further. Are you close enough to getting blamed banned from school? I want to be banned from outside of school too. That's a thing, right? Alright, let's go. Yeah, well, I guess we're just heading home. I don't really feel like I want to go home, but I'm still stuck in a traffic jam, even though it's only one other person. This is a great parking place. I can see myself settling down here.
Little buddy, you aren't gonna believe this. I've got a girlfriend. Asriel, you've got to tell Asriel right now. He's gonna be so proud of me. Huh? What you looking like? Ah, oh, little buddy, how do I put it? I don't actually know. I haven't met her in real life. But from the way she texts, God, little buddy, she must be stacked. Stop. That's right, we don't need to say more. Go ahead and tell Asriel right now. Hey, what's up? Hey, welcome to the convenience store. Wanna buy something, put it in the basket and bring it here. In case you didn't know what a store was. Shit, I only got two dollars. Hey, you the boss around here? Me? I'm just the janitor. And where's the cashier? Cashier? We don't have one. And who the who do we buy stuff from? Me. And what that makes you the cashier? Nope, I'm the janitor. I'm just filling in. Are there any other employees? Nope. Then why don't you hire someone else? Whoa, you think I can afford that on a janitor's salary? Sorry kid, the brother thing's gonna have to wait. How long? Maybe a day, maybe another two years. Who's keeping track at this point? Pam, 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 Chris, you going home? I guess so. All right. Then, I guess it's goodbye for today. See you tomorrow, Chris. Chris, how was studying with your... Why, Chris, is that your friend? Why don't you invite her inside? Uh, I mean, I, uh... Chris, I should um, probably get going and... I was going to bake a pie. Did you want any? Hell yeah. <laughs> guess I can come over for a bit. Uh... Always the appetite that gets them. Feel free to come in. Oh, excuse me. I am Chris's mother, Toriel. Yes, ma'am, I remember. Oh, you do and you are... Susie, are you not? Um, huh? You uh, remember my name too? Of course, Miss Alphys is a good friend of mine. She often talks about you. Um, glad to hear it. Chris, the hell self is saying about me? Well, why no, man? Susie, why don't you wash your hands over there? Then we can make the pie together. Make it together? Duh, but I don't know how to. Do not worry, I can teach you. Okay. <laughs> it's just locking up always. Chris, Susie seems like a nice girl. I am very happy you are friends with her, but... Chris, I heard from Alfie's about her behavior. By any chance she uh, influences you, or uh, leave the chuck alone, all right? Hands up, washed. Wonderful, now we can... Oh, Chris, how about you show Susie how to bake it? Chris, you know how to make pie? The hell haven't you made me any then, dumbass? You pie hoarding pizza. I mean, uh, excuse me, ma'am. Susie, you can just call me Toriel outside of school. Oh, uh, okay, sweet. Huh, Chris? Oh, you need to wash your hands too. Then, I suppose I shall teach to Susie for now. Susie and I will start getting ready to make the pie. No, we will. Wait!
My pie and my rules. <laughs> Why are those metal people shaped in the cupboard? Like uh, handcuffs for little guy's whole body? Those are for gingerbread. Gingerbread men and gingerbread monsters, of course. <laughs> of course. Dang it. Nani? In the toilet? How many assaults are you gonna keep doing that on? Well, let us get the flower. So that's this bag, and you just. Oops! Hehehe, <laughs> Susie, you have flower on your nose. Well, uh, I meant to do that. Thought you would stop to smell the flower, eh? Yeah, it's you! Come on. Now, on to the next part. So, where the uh, uh, heck is Chris? Oh, Chris, er, is this sometimes? Well, they should hurry. I'm getting sleepy. Do you know what they call a sleeping Susie? Oh, what? They would call her snoo a snoozy. The daha, then. And I guess you'd be a Snoriel? Wait, so Toriel is aware of this. This is just a normal thing Chris does. She just. He just. An occasion rips out her soul, his soul, and then goes around being soulless, and we're all just okay with this. Snoozy and Snoriel. No, oh, <laughs> you really like that one, huh? Wasn't it funny? All right, where the hell is Chris? Pie is nearly done. Oh, the sugar. Wait here a moment. I left it in the car. Okay. Oh, look. You're back. That'll be epic. That's all is our medium of control for him. I guess he wants to do something he doesn't want us to see. Yeah, give give Chris his privacy, I guess. Or her, I don't know. Hey Chris, hurry up next time. We're already almost done. So what's next? Oh, uh, the pie. We already worked quite hard, have we not? How about we finish it later? What? Then, uh, guess I'll walk home. Wait! Oh, shit! Oh, shit! Oh, shit! Okay, hear me out, but I got a theory. The night is Chris. And whenever he rips out his heart, 
and goes off screen, that's when he sets up new portal thingies. He's the one building them. That's how chapter 1 ended. And that's how chapter 2 ended as well. And now in chapter 3 there's gonna be another fountain. I'm calling it. I'm calling it. Chris is setting up these fountains for some reason. And then cleaning them up. For some reason. Himself. Oh no no. There's no need to do that. Oh actually. Susie. Would you like to stay over? Huh? I mean um. Uh, if it's okay then. Here. Look at this. Our couch is used to being used as a bed. It's not perfect, but we could all sleep out here. That sounds good to me, yeah. What about your parents? Splendid, I will make sure everything is in order. Toriel sure can be aggressive when she wants to. Just call your parents, will you not? Yeah, of course. So, what the hell? Sleepover? Damn, I haven't had one of those in forever. <laughs> hey Chris, it's not like someone has to tell you to sit, right? There, chill out for a sec. So, now what? I got it. Maybe between the pillows here? There, I knew I'd find a remote in me there. You can always find good stuff wedged in the couch. Jeez, it's dusty. When did you last use this thing? Well, who cares? Let's just watch TV. What are we gonna marathon tonight? Blood Crushers 3, Hellbusters, Invasion of the Cat Patters. How about some anime? Mew Mew, whatever, whatever. <laughs> Maybe I see the movies more your speed, huh, Chris? <laughs> been a good day, huh, Chris? You, Ralph, say, Lancer, everyone? It's the school hangout together, right? That's why, you know, don't you think we should try to have them come to our world? Come on, think about how much better it would be. Ralph, they could do our homework. Lancer could live under your bed. We could all walk to school together. It'd be perfect, you know? I mean, we'd be unstoppable is what I'm saying. Uh, you think it's possible? What? Come on, it'd be easy. I'll say it looks like your mom, right? Just say he's a long lost cousin, it'd be easy. Lancer can even make him a fake mustache. Well, whatever, let's just get back to watching. But the festival's coming up, right? That thing where the town becomes a carnival? I guess that's gonna be chapter 3. Stupid, right? Let's say you had to, uh, take someone. Well, or I'll say. You! Yeah, just give Ralph, just give Susie a harem. There, yeah, Chris, Noel, Ralph, say. Even Lancer can join in. Fuck yeah. Susie's just gonna get all the lovers. Way to dodge the question, dumbass. I mean, if I went, obviously you'd be there too. I goes without saying, right? Look, let's just go back to watching TV. Now this is what I'm talking about, the giant monster movie special. I was like them because of the giant, better than the giant human movies. Now this is something we can marathon. Are you ready, Chris? For 12 hours of building, bashing, car crunching action. So we are locked in, got it. I better not see you move until your eyes are bloodshot. <laughs> now let me just get comfortable here and sleep. There. Hold on.
Yep. Lucy fell asleep. Yikes. What a snore. And we fell asleep as well. Amazing. Officer, officer. Thank goodness I finally got through. I thought I saw someone prowling around outside. And when I checked our car, the tires looked like they've been slashed. Officer, if you could please come over. You will soon, thank you. They're already asleep. Yeah, I'm, pre I'm guessing Chris did that as well. So that Chris can walk to the carnival on his own and then do their usual adventure again or something. Uh, I guess my theory confirmed very quickly. Maybe the knight is possessing Chris. The, uh, the knight's some sort of evil guy. And since we're playing as Chris and we don't know it, and that's like sort of the thing they're doing. So our greatest enemies like ourselves or something. Anyway, I guess the dark world is this. Next. Our house. Isn't that epic? Yeah, this knight has possessed our dear main character and it ain't good. So never mind. Chris isn't aware he doesn't he doesn't do the thing of his own accord. He's saving the world because that's what he knows, but he doesn't know what happens whenever he gets his soul ripped out by the night guy. I'll just have to wait and see in the next episode. Tune in next time or something. Coming soon in like 10 million years, maybe. Interesting. What the fuck? Seven chapters? Oh damn. I said three, four, and five. Or are they all gonna release at the same time or something? How about six and seven? The beginning of Cyber's world. Yeah, when in chapter one ending with him taking out the knife. That was basically confirming, yeah. So that's my current prevailing theory. The knife, the knight, is Chris, but technically not. Uh, the knight, maybe he doesn't have a form or something. So the only way for him to do his job is if, you know, he possesses someone. 
uh, but uh, since only one person can be in control of something at a time, he has to first uh, rip apart Chris's control, a Chris aka us, from him, so that the knight can do his stuff. But he can't do his stuff for long, otherwise people would be suspicious. So every now and then he lets Chris get control back. Yeah, I'm done.